A massive manhunt for Arizona prison escapee John McCluskey and his girlfriend and alleged accomplice Castlin Welch is over. The two are in police custody after nearly three weeks on the run. ABC News says the pair, who have been described by authorities as a modern-day Bonnie and Clyde, were arrested late on Thursday, August 19, 2010, at a campground in eastern Arizona. McCluskey and Welch had been on the run since late July 2010, evading authorities in at least six states before they were caught. U.S. Marshal David Gonzalez said in a press conference to announce the captures that the nightmare that began July 30th is finally over. Authorities say a forest ranger investigating an unattended campfire noticed a suspicious car backed into some trees. A license plate check revealed that the car was stolen and this led authorities to suspect that the campers were fugitives McCluskey and Welch. A SWAT team moved in quickly and apprehended the pair at the campsite. ABC News says McCluskey and Welch were caught off guard. Gonzalez says that McCluskey indicated in a statement after his arrest that if he'd gotten back to the tent, there was a gun there, and he would have killed the officers involved, adding that he wished he had killed the forest ranger when he had first seen him. McCluskey and two other inmates escaped from a private prison near Kingman, Arizona, allegedly with the help of Welch, who was identified by the Associated Press as McCluskey's fiancé and cousin. The two inmates were recaptured, but McCluskey and Welch remained on the run, suspected now in the murders of a vacationing Oklahoma couple found dead on a New Mexico ranch on August 4th. 2010. The AP says the arrests were made shortly after a report was released outlining a series of embarrassing security breakdowns at the prison that allowed the inmates to escape. For more information on this topic, visit the link below.